So if we miss, yeah. heads over our front foot, weights on the front foot, back leg will come off the floor, we're going to be off balance. The power, yeah. You, power, still, right? you don't lose any power. You yeah, probably gain more yeah. power. Can you explain me how do you put the weight on the jab? So, we're in our stance, stance yeah. guard, yeah? yeah? So as we throw the jab, mm -hmm. we're going to screw that left hand out, a knee yeah. hand, we're going to screw it out. But what we don't want to do is put our weight on, on the front foot. Because as we put the weight on the front foot, our head's going to go over our front foot, thus distributing the weight outside of your stance. Okay. So then you're going to fall off balance, or you're open to the counter. Yeah. So if we, what we want to try and do, as we throw that jab, turn it, we can step, but we don't want to put our head over our front foot. The weight should be going on the back foot. Right. Yeah, so we step in, bang. Oh. We're sort of going forward, but going backwards as such. Yeah. So then that, what happens there, that brings us nice and tight. Right hand is up. Your rear hand is up. Protecting your face. There. So step in. There. Yeah? So there. Step. Bang. Once we do that, look. So if we miss, heads over our front foot, weights on the front foot, back leg will come off the floor, we will be off balance. And it's a solid punch. Yes, there. Yeah. Straight. Straight. Straight foot. Also, why are you going with a... The cross, it looks more powerful to me when I want to Well, what you're doing, as you throw the jab, you're putting the weight on the back foot, so we're, 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 we're spring loading it to throw the cross. So now we come through. Yeah. The weight then goes on to the front foot. So back foot, front foot, we turn it through. What we must do as well is rotate that, rotate your waist. Turn your waist, turn your feet. Everything works from the feet to start with, okay? Straight through, there, there, straight. Yeah. yeah, that's your classic one two. One of the big news we do for me was the body weight because I always said, you know, the depth you drop step, yeah. put the weight forward, put the weight forward. But I have to say, people see the, the power, yeah. You, power, you, still, right? you don't lose any power. You yeah. probably gain more yeah. power. Yeah. Because when you put the weight on the front foot, half the time, you're losing power there. Mm. Losing power there because you're falling over yourself. There, it's a straighter shot, it's an accurate, more accurate shot. Plus, when you do that, yeah. that automatically brings your shoulder up, protecting your chin. There. Okay. Also, my cross, I feel it's solid. Yeah, because solid. even just with a single cross, you just even without throwing the jab, when you throw the cross, there. The most important thing is to turn your feet and turn your waist. Now, if I just throw the shot from my arm, I'm here, right? Now, I'm not going to move my feet, but I'm just, I'm just going to turn my waist and turn my feet. Right, so look, how much further extension on my arm do I get? Just by turning my waist, that much reach, that extra reach, instead of that. So there, always turn through, turn through, and then once we step, bang, we're through. But we're always protecting our chin. So now, weight distribution, transferring the weight from different feet, there, there we can get the hook in, back hand so everything is flowing. There, we can even throw the other cut. Now, transfer the weight, you'll keep punching. Yeah. Once you stop transferring the weight and your feet go flat, now you only have about two punches, three maximum. There, look, so that, that, now where am I going? Falling over myself. Always keep on your toes. There, there, round, round, that, up, boom, straight. Okay? Is it how you do it? Comment below.